guys, welcome to today's video. So today I'm gonna to be sharing my top five body sunscreen recommendations for 2022. If you haven't seen my latest video on my go-to face sunscreens, then I will leave that video below for you in my description box as well as up here. Now body sunscreens are just as important and it's really important to find one that you love that you will use on a regular basis. So I do have some different options here at different price points, different formulations and textures. I also have four SPF 50s and one SPF 30. So hopefully I can introduce you to something new today. So let's get right into it, but don't forget to subscribe and ring that notification bell. And also don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up as well. So the first product is by Eucerin and I recently picked this up as I thought this would be a great option for those low key days, those days where you're running a couple of errands but you're coming right back home or you're working from home but you're still gonna be near a window because remember that sun is still coming through your windows, it can still give you a sunburn and cause skin damage. So even though I work from home and I'm home a lot, I still wear a body sunscreen as well as a face sunscreen, especially the areas that are being exposed to the sun. So this one here is great for those low key days. So this is the Eucerin Daily Hydration Cream. So this is a body moisturizer that contains an SPF 30. This is also a broad spectrum, which is really important. So when you're looking for a body or a face sunscreen, you want broad spectrum because this will protect your skin from both UVA and UVB rays. This also contains four chemical filters, which is avobenzone, homosalate, octisalate, and octocrylin. And this does have have that slight sunscreen smell and typically I don't like that scent when it comes to the face but for the body I don't mind too much because it's not constantly in my face as if I was wearing a chemical face sunscreen when it's on the body I don't smell it too much this is very lightweight it's also very moisturizing as well but it's not too greasy and it's not too heavy so this is great for those that have drier skin but this is also great if you just have normal skin the only downfall that I will say with this is that it's not water resistant which is fine because with a product like this like I said this is good for those low-key days now if you're gonna be outside playing sports you're gonna be in water and you plan on sweating a lot that's when you want to resort to a water resistant sunscreen so that it doesn't drip off your skin it's still going to repel the water so this one again is not water resistant but this is fragrance free this retails around $15 Canadian and you're getting 226 grams of product so if you're into moisturizers that contain sunscreen then perhaps you may want to check out this one the next one is by La Roche-Posay, and this is the Anthelius Mineral SPF 50. This is a broad spectrum, and this is also water resistant up to 80 minutes. And this also has that lotion consistency. So it spreads across the skin nice, and it's not greasy, it's not sticky, and it dries down skin-like. And I think that's really important when it comes to a body sunscreen. I hate when my clothes stick to my sunscreen. I really hate that and you won't get that with this product in particular. And this is also another one that you could use on your face. So you can use your body sunscreens on your face, but sometimes these formulations can be a little bit heavier, a little bit greasy and oily. So I typically don't like using my body sunscreens on my face because I worry about breaking out. But with this one, I would use on tops of my ears, my neck. I would apply this everywhere. This is also fragrance free and this has a titanium dioxide of 14.8% and this is also great for those that have sensitive skin. So this retails around $32 Canadian and you are getting 125 mils of product. The next one is by Pipette, and this is the Mineral Sunscreen Broad Spectrum SPF 50. This is baby safe, it's fragrance free, it's non-toxic and clean, and this has a zinc oxide of 20%. I also really like this because of how moisturizing it is, so if you are on the drier side, I think that you will love it. But I will say it's a little bit on the greasier side, so my clothes 
do stick to my skin when I'm using this. So I only use this on my neck, my chest, my arms, and legs when I don't have any clothing in those areas. So if I'm wearing shorts, a sleeveless top, maybe a strapless dress, I will use this because this gives that nice added glow and radiance to the skin. So I love that dewy glowy complexion for my face. So if I am wearing a strapless dress or something, I will use this on my neck and chest so that I can bring that glow down so that everything flows together and it looks really beautiful. This is not water resistant so again not a great choice if you're going to be near water but I think that this is a lovely option especially if you're looking for a zinc oxide that is at a higher percentage. So again this is at a 20% and this retails around $17 Canadian and you are getting 120 mils of product. The next one is by Blue Lizard. So this is an Australian sunscreen, and this is my first time trying something from this brand, and I'm quite impressed. So this is an SPF 50, 100% mineral, broad spectrum. This is also water resistant up to 80 minutes. This has a zinc oxide of 6%, a titanium dioxide of 9%. It's fragrance free, reef safe, and perfect for those that have sensitive skin. I also really love the ingredients as well. So there's antioxidants in here, vitamin E, cucumber and papaya extract, there's aloe, there's shea butter, and the list goes on. So I really do love the ingredient list. I also love how moisturizing this is, but I will say that this does leave a slight, slight white cast. It's nothing crazy, but if you do have a darker skin tone, there's a subtle cast. So of course I wanted to make sure that I mentioned that to you guys. This is also a product that you could use on your face, but I do feel like it's a little bit too heavy and thick to apply to the face. You could try, but for me personally, I just fear that this would break me out. So I'm going to strictly keep this for my body. And again, it's another great option if you're gonna be around water in plain sports. So this retails at $21.99 Canadian and you are getting 89 mils of product. And the last sunscreen that I'm gonna be recommending is one of my favorites and the one that I've been using the longest. And it's by Color Science. And this is the Sun Forgettable Total Protection Body Shield. So this is 100% mineral. This is a broad spectrum, water resistant up to 80 minutes. It's an SPF 50 with a PA++++. And this has a zinc oxide of 12%. This also comes in two shades. So I have the original one, which comes in a beigey tone, but there is a bronze option. If you are someone that has darker skin or you're always tanned, that might be a lovely option to resort to. I personally haven't tried it, but this one is lovely and I don't experience a white cast with this whatsoever. It's lightweight, it's not greasy or sticky, and it dries down skin-like. So if you're into color science, you wanna try something different, I would say pick this up. There's two shades, like I said. You are getting 120 mils of product, and I do believe this retails at $46 American. I'm not gonna lie, it can be pricey, and not everybody wants to pay that, but for me, this is worth it. And I just purchased another one because I feel like I have this much left. So this is a necessity for this coming summer, and I cannot recommend it enough. So those are my top five body sunscreen recommendations for 2022. I really hope that you enjoyed this video and that you found it helpful and hopefully I introduced you to something new today. Of course, I will leave all of the products that I shared in this video below for you for your reference. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And of course, I will see you all in the next one. Take care and I will see you guys then. Bye guys.